Hello guys and welcome to the Total Hardcore channel where you can find the most hardcore total war content and here we will have another room 2 series with the mod divide 8 imperial as always and this will be a this is Sparta! campaign are you ready let's go Okay, so what is a Caesar Sparta campaign? We will have a few roles in this one. The first role is this is total war. We are the Sparta. We will have non-stop war. The second role is only Sparta unit. We will use no mercenary or area of recruitment unit. The third role will be only taking slave after battle. No ransoming, no executing only taking slaves and the final rule is we will not be allowed to retreat on the campaign map the sparta fight and died in battle we will not retreat now for the first part of the campaign let's do some diplomacy stuff the sparta the way upon you. What then do you madness War to the end, then. this is sparta <laughs> Be most welcome. Or only the jackals and carrion birds will thank you for this foolishness. The first step is done. Now the king will let his army to attack Athens right away. The Athens try to sally out and fight us on the battlefield. We are few in number, but we are proud and strong Sparta warriors. Let us fight the Athens and show them the true strength of the Sparta. The Sparta cavalry move in first and use their javelins to harass the enemy. They then retreat back to the infantry, leading the Athens cavalry into a trap. The Athenian cavalry are completely surrounded by the Sparta hoplite. That's the end for them. The Athens general got caught by the Sparta Hoplite as well, and we will not let him escape. The enemy general is dead. The enemy general is dead. Good news for us. The enemy cavalry quickly route, fighting against the Royal Sparta Hoplite, supported by Sparta cavalry. Now the cavalry can move around and start attacking the enemy missile unit.
it's not too long until all of the enemy rain unit route. Now with only the hoplites left on the battlefield, we can separate them and kill them one by one. We have the king and another general over here. That's two units of the royal Sparta. 300 of very strong, fearsome warriors that can break the enemy very quickly. This warrior just destroys the Athens supply with ease. And finally, the Athen army break and run away. The first victory of the Sparta. Of course, we take all of the Athens captives here as slaves. The other Greek faction come here to attack us, trying to save the Athens, but we show them that how foolish they are. The cavalry go in first at Orway and get the enemy cavalry to chase after it. Once the enemy cavalry got caught by the Sparta Hoplite, it's the end for them. One of our units has used all its ammunition. The Greek infantry are actually pretty dangerous with their javelin and they managed to do a lot of damage to our prior coil hoplite. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. But then the Greek infantry are no match to our Sparta hoplite. Once we can catch them in melee, it's the end for them.
We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. The Athens come back here with a few archers, and they are flying at our royal Sparta. But we still have our Sparta cavalry here to deal with this pesky archer. Now again, all the cavalry, melee infantry and missile units are dead. All the enemy have left now are some hope line, so we can just separate and kill them one by one. Even so, the hoplite can still inflict some casualty to our unit. And finally, another victory for Sparta. We take these captives as slaves as well. Journey completed. For glory and honor. Now, without any army or garrison left, Athens is free for it to take. So this will be the first episode of our Zit is Sparta campaign. There will be a lot more enemy we have to defeat, but Sparta will prevail. Thank you very much for watching, and see you guys in the next episode.